So we're going to try we're going to try to calculate what the equation of this line is. I've drawn it over the thing, and then we're going to write it in here once we're happy with what what it is, uh, what the equation is, um, and uh, and then we're going to see if it comes up. So remember, the equation is going to be something like y equals m x plus c. So we just need to work out what is c and what is is what is m. Okay. So have a th have a look at the line and think what what do you think it is. So. So yeah, we can see it intersects the y-axis at four. So the y-intercept is four. So that's why we can put that there. We just now need to find out the gradient, which is the harder bit to work out what what number to put there. Okay, so let's have a go at that. Uh, okay, so we've realized that we've seen that the second coordinate was zero, four. So the y, uh, the x uh, coordinate was zero because it's on the y-axis and the uh, y coordinate is 4. And then the first one was negative 4, negative 4. So the change in x as it goes from here to here is just 4. And the change in y as it goes all the way all, from here all the way up to the top is, is 8. So, so to work out the um, gradient, uh, which is the m value, we do the change in y, remember, divided by the change in x. And that's that's equal to 8 divided by four, which is equal to two. So what's the final um, equation for our graph then? So yeah, so the equation should hopefully be y equals two x plus four. So if I type this into here, y equals two, I'm going to actually turn that one off and I'm going to just write y equals two x plus four. Then we're gonna see, does it appear over the top of the line that I've drawn? Yeah, it does. Awesome. Can you see that? Yeah. So, um, so that appears right over the top. So that means we've got it right. Awesome. So, uh, that's how to um, that's how to work out the equation for a straight line graph.